Ever looked at your bank account and thought, investing with what money? You're not alone. Many believe investing is for the wealthy, a game reserved for those with fat wallets and fancy suits. But here's a secret. You don't need a fortune to start investing. Think of a tiny seed. It seems insignificant, but with the right conditions, it grows into a mighty tree. Investing with little money is like planting that seed. It's about starting small, nurturing your money, and watching it grow over time. This isn't about getting rich quick schemes. It's about building a solid financial future brick by brick, even with just a few dollars at a time. Ready to plant your seed and watch it flourish? Let's get started. You might be thinking, what difference can a few bucks really make? The answer, a world of difference. It's not just about the amount you invest initially, but the habits you build and the magic of compound interest. Starting small forces you to be disciplined and consistent. It's about making investing a regular part of your life, no matter how much you can afford at the moment. Like brushing your teeth or paying your bills, investing should be a non-negotiable. Don't underestimate the power of small, consistent actions. Over time, these small contributions add up, creating a snowball effect that can lead to significant wealth accumulation. Remember, even the longest journey begins with a single step. Micro-investing is like the superhero of small-scale investing. These platforms allow you to invest spare change from everyday purchases. Imagine this, you buy a coffee for $3.50, and the app rounds it up to $4, investing the extra 50 cents. It might seem insignificant, but those small amounts invested consistently can grow surprisingly fast. Plus, many micro-investing apps offer low fees and user-friendly interfaces, making them perfect for beginners. Some apps even let you invest in fractional shares, meaning you can own a tiny piece of a company even if you can't afford a whole share. This opens up a world of possibilities, allowing you to invest in companies you believe in, even with limited funds. I can barely afford my bills. How can I possibly invest? We've all been there. But here's the thing. You don't need a massive income to start investing. You need a solid budget. Start by tracking your expenses for a month. Where is your money going? You'll likely find areas where you can cut back, even by a small amount. That daily latte? Maybe switch to homemade coffee a few times a week. Once you've identified areas to trim, redirect that money towards your investment goals. Even $20 or $50 a week can make a difference over time. Remember, it's not about sacrificing your lifestyle, but about making conscious choices that align with your financial goals. Section 5. The Magic of Compound Interest – Your Money Snowball Effect Compound interest is like the fairy godmother of investing. It's the process of earning interest on your initial investment plus any accumulated interest. In simple terms, your money starts earning money and then that money earns even more money. The longer you invest, the more powerful compound interest becomes. It's like a snowball rolling downhill, gathering more snow and momentum as it goes. Even small contributions, when invested consistently over time, can grow into a substantial sum. Think of it this way. Investing early, even with small amounts, allows you to harness the power of time. The earlier you start, the longer your money has to grow and compound, leading to potentially significant returns in the long run. Section 6 Index Funds and ETFs Riding the Market Wave Investing in individual stocks can be intimidating, especially for beginners. Index funds and ETFs offer a simpler and often less risky approach. Think of them as baskets of stocks that track a specific market index like the S&P 500. When you invest in an index fund or ETF, you're essentially buying a small piece of all the companies included in that index. This diversification helps to spread your risk as you're not relying on the performance of a single company. These investment vehicles are known for their low fees and potential for long-term growth. They're like the reliable car in your investment garage, offering a smoother ride than trying to navigate the stock market on your own. Section 7. Inspirational Stories from Pennies to Prosperity Don't just take our word for it. Listen to the real-life experiences of those who have walked this path before you. Countless individuals started investing with limited funds and achieved remarkable financial success. They began with just a few dollars, but their dedication and smart choices made all the difference. Their stories are a testament to the power of patience, consistency, and smart investing habits. 
These principles, when applied diligently, can lead to extraordinary outcomes. Take, for instance, the story of a young waitress who diligently saved and invested a portion of her tips each month. Despite her modest income, she remained committed to her financial goals. Years later, she retired comfortably, her small, consistent investments having blossomed into a sizable nest egg. Her story is a shining example of how perseverance pays off. Or the single parent who, despite facing financial challenges, committed to investing a small amount in index funds every month. This parent understood the importance of securing a better future. Over time, their investment grew, providing financial security for their family and funding their children's education. The impact of their disciplined approach was profound. These stories, while unique in their details, share a common thread. They demonstrate that financial success is attainable for anyone willing to start small, stay consistent, and make informed investment decisions. The journey may be long, but the rewards are worth it. Your story could be next. The first step is to begin, no matter how small. Section 8. Overcoming Fear and Inertia. Taking the First Step. Fear and procrastination are the biggest roadblocks to investing, especially when you're starting small. These feelings can be paralyzing, making it difficult to take that crucial first step. It's easy to feel overwhelmed or tell yourself, I'll start next month. But delaying only makes the process more daunting. But here's the truth. The best time to plant a tree was 20 years ago. This old adage holds true for investing as well. The second best time is now. Every day you wait is a missed opportunity for growth. Don't let fear paralyze you. Confront it head on and take control of your financial future. Remember, you don't need to be a financial expert to start investing. Everyone starts somewhere and it's okay to begin with the basics. There are countless resources available to help you learn and make informed decisions. From books to online courses, the information is at your fingertips. Start by educating yourself about basic investment principles and strategies. Knowledge is power, and it will give you the confidence to move forward. Take that first step, no matter how small. Open a micro-investing account, set up a budget, or start tracking your expenses, or research low-cost index funds. These are great starting points for new investors. The key is to start somewhere and keep moving forward. Each small action builds momentum, action breeds confidence, and each step you take brings you closer to your financial goals. Celebrate your progress and keep pushing forward. Section 9. Building a Solid Financial Foundation Beyond Investing Investing is crucial for building wealth, but it's only one piece of the puzzle. It's important to understand that a comprehensive financial strategy goes beyond just putting money into stocks or bonds. A solid financial foundation requires a holistic approach that encompasses budgeting, debt management, and emergency savings. These elements work together to create a stable base upon which you can build your financial future. Before diving headfirst into investing, ensure you have a handle on your finances. This means understanding where your money is going and making sure you are not overspending in any area. Create a realistic budget that tracks your income and expenses, allowing you to identify areas where you can save and invest more. A well-planned budget is the cornerstone of financial health. If you're burdened by high interest debt, prioritize paying it down as quickly as possible. High interest debt can erode your financial stability and limit your ability to invest effectively. Debt acts like a financial anchor, weighing you down and hindering your ability to build wealth through investing. Eliminating debt frees up resources that can be redirected towards growth opportunities. Finally, establish an emergency fund to cover unexpected expenses such as medical bills or car repairs. This fund acts as a financial buffer protecting you from unforeseen financial shocks. Having this financial safety net provides peace of mind and prevents you from dipping into your investments when unexpected costs arise. A well-prepared emergency fund ensures that your investment strategy remains intact even in times of crisis. Section 10. Staying the course, patience and persistence in investing. Investing is a marathon, not a sprint. It's about making consistent contributions over time and riding out the inevitable market fluctuations. Don't expect to get rich quick or be discouraged by short-term market volatility. Remember the seed analogy? It takes time for a seed to germinate, grow roots, and eventually flourish into a tree. Similarly, your investments need time to grow and compound. Stay patient, stay the course, and trust in the power of long-term investing. 
Avoid the temptation to constantly check your portfolio or make impulsive decisions based on market noise. Remember your investment strategy and focus on your long-term goals. Time is your greatest ally in investing. Section 11. Your journey to financial freedom, start small, dream big. Starting to invest with little money might feel insignificant, but it's a powerful act of self-care and a testament to your belief in a brighter financial future. It's about taking control of your finances one small step at a time. Remember, you don't need to be a millionaire to start investing. You just need the right mindset, the willingness to learn, and the commitment to consistency. Start small, stay focused, and watch as your financial seeds blossom into a future filled with possibilities. The journey to financial freedom starts with a single step. Take that step today and embrace the transformative power of investing even with just a few dollars at a time. Your future self will thank you.